Allah, my dear students of ninth class, I welcome you all in in my class. Uh, this would be the last topic of our chapter, natural vegetation and wildlife. And the topic, selected topic for today is wildlife of India. What we, what do we mean by wildlife? As we have discussed it earlier in the earlier lectures that wildlife is the fauna or the animal life of India. And India is having a rich uh, diversity of this animal life or the fauna or the wildlife let us uh, recall the previous study that natural vegetation and wildlife plants and animals both exist only in the biosphere and are interlinked and dependent on one another for survival like plants are dependent on animals and animals are dependent on plants and other animals also and this structure in this this interdependence is known as ecosystem okay and this both this vegetation and wildlife flora and fauna are extremely important resources and hence are the important part of geography and the distribution of this flora and fauna in india is influenced by the relief factors like um, this um, land and soil climate where we have temperature rainfall photo period etc and also we discussed various types of vegetation various types of forests okay like in this picture you can see that india is having a rich diversity of in this animal life like we have 8900 sometime somewhere you can see in you can find it 81 and in your book you will find it as 89000 of animal species are found in india and our country is having 1200 species of birds okay and which constitutes 13 percent of the world's total and there are again 2500 species of fish aquatic animals which accounts for nearly 12 percent of the world's stock okay and also uh, this um, world in this uh, it shares this one this shares five to eight percent of the world's amphibian reptiles and mammals okay eight five point eight percent of the uh, world's amphibians reptiles and mammals do we possess in our india this is not the this is a this is just a statistical figure and you need not to remember it thoroughly okay let us go here you can see it is uh, 81 100 species of fauna found in in our india okay now let us go to the wildlife of india the animals found in india like we have elephants in india elephants are found in assam karnataka and kerala or one horned rhinos are found in assam and west bengal okay again rich ass this wild ass is found in kutch run of kutch and other arid areas we have camels in thar desert we have lions and tigers in gir forest uh, tigers are found in madhya pradesh sundarban Ban, Sundar, sundarban deltas which is found in west bengal and these tigers particularly are there are known are known as white tigers are found there white tigers or bengal tiger they are uh, named as bengal tigers again you can find here we have yak wild ox tibetan antelope we have barrel which is also called as blue sheep we have kyang uh, this tibetan world uh, this wild ass in ladakh and Himali himalayas we we can find a red panda we have ibex we have snow leopard and we have bear also we have only nation to have both 
this um, India is the only nation. India is the only country where we find both lions and tigers at a time. There is no other country where lions and these lions and tigers are found. Okay, somewhere it, the, there are only lions and somewhere there are only tigers. And we we know that there is an importance uh, of these animals, these uh, fauna, fauna, okay, like uh, it is summarized here, the importance of wild animals that these milch animals, the animals giving us milk, what is their importance? They provide us milk, they pro provide us, us draught, they provide us meat, they give us eggs. Okay, again, fish. Fish is a native food. This fish is directly consumed by humans, and these insects, insects on are all also useful. They help in pollination, that is, breeding, breeding of various plants and germination of various plants. Here you can see somewhere it is 14 that india has 14 biosphere reserves and some new biosphere reserves are added to this and the count goes to 18 okay and the important of these four uh, biosphere reserves are sundarbans that is found in west bengal it is nanda devi which is found in Arunachal pradesh we have the gulf of manar which is in tamil nadu and the nilgiris which is in, found in kerala karnataka and tamil nadu these have been included in the world network of biosphere reserves also for the conservation of animals because we know that the wild life or the fauna of the uh, of any country this is very precious uh, resource we can say and uh, we know that the greed of animal this uh, man the various types of animals various species of animals have got extinct and some animals are getting endangered and some animals are getting vulnerable and various projects and various and these uh, and these um, I, we can say that steps have been taken by the government to conserve these animals because there is an utmost need to conserve both plants and animals because of their numerous and the utmost value for the human beings either in short we can say if plants and animals would not be here no and um, this uh, life would be possible on our earth and government has uh, done various uh, assignments for this various steps for this like we have project tiger project rhino we have project great indian bastard and many other and eco developmental projects have been introduced here in India, again, there are 89 national parks, 49 wildlife sanctuaries and zoological gardens are set up only to conserve this natural heritage, to set up to take care of this natural heritage. Okay, here you can see nine uh, important biosphere reserves out of these 18 biosphere reserves which are which you can see here and the animals uh, associated um, with this or the conservation of the animal uh, associated with this and the states where you can find these we will definitely inshallah i'll i'll show you a map and uh, from that very map you can understand it very well like we have in first number we have nilgiri nilgiri biosphere reserves that is found in tamil nadu kerala and karnataka that we saw earlier and uh, for which animal it is established for which animal it is uh, it is made to conserve okay it is nilgiri tahar line tailed um, this macau okay in second number we have gulf of manar by Sefer. okay that is found in tamil nadu we have dugong sea cow there where um, the conservation of sea um, this uh, sea cow is done there we have sundarban national park which is very well known and is found in west bengal which is made for the conservation of royal bengal tiger we have nanda devi biosphere reserves which is found in uttarakhand and various 
various species of animals birds also are there for conservation we have we have nokrek biosphere reserve which is in meghalaya particularly uh, done for the conservation of red panda we have panchma marhi biosphere reserve in madhya pradesh for the conservation of giant particularly giant squirrel flying squirrel there are other animals as well uh, this, we have simlipal biosphere reserve which is found in uh, this odisha and for the conservation of royal bengal tiger wild elephant and gaur we have achana achanakmar this um, or amarkantak biosphere reserve which is found in chatisgarh and madhya pradesh uh, for the conservation of wide range of flora and fauna wide wide uh, species of plant plants and animals are found there we have nikobar islands where this nikobar island uh, biosphere reserve which is found in andaman and nikobar islands and the salt water crocodile is conserved there here you can see various wildlife sanctuaries found in india made to conserve this wildlife the nat this national heritage first at first number you can see it is hazari bag sanctuary found in bihar for the conservation of tiger and leopard we have gana bird sanctuary which is found in rajasthan and 300 species or of birds are found there for their conservation we have sultanpur bird sanctuary which is found in haryana and where migratory birds are conserved and fat we have adohar wildlife sanctuary in punjab while where this black buck is conserved we have nal sarovar bird sanctuary in gujarat where water birds are conserved we have mudhamalai wildlife sanctuary in tamil nadu where tiger elephant leopard is conserved we have vadan thangal bird sanctuary in tamil nadu where water birds are conserved we have wild ass sanctuary that's found in gujarat where wild ass and wolf jinkara is conserved there we have jaldapara wildlife sanctuary in west bengal where rhinoceros and this elephant and tiger is conserved here you can see a map of national parks in india you can see state wise we have north most we have this hemis high altitude national park we have kishtwar national park we have great himalayas national park we have valley of flowers national park we have corbett national park we have sariska national park dudua is here desert <coughs> this um, rajasthan desert and be is found here we have ranthambore here we have shivpur here going to assam we have kaziranga we have this we have this bandhavarga we have sanje we have panch we have kanha nagzari tabo tadoba we have we have indravati we have kankar valley national park we have this like various uh, other national parks are like we have bandhipur silent valley these are all the national parks found in our india little ran of kanch is here sanjay gandhi national park is here we have molan national park uh, you can see this map very well which is also found in internet and your book also you can see it now going to the wildlife sanctuaries this red color is showing the wildlife sanctuaries the sanctuaries made to conserve the wildlife both plants and animals okay done by the government of india like from north you can see Uh, we have disu 
दिस वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी वी हैव किश्तवार नेशनल पार्क हेमिस हाई आल्टीट्यूड विच वी सेड दाची गाम वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी इज देयर विच विच इज इन आवर दिस कश्मीर वैली ओके वी हैव वी हैव घामगोल एंड श्रेया वी हैव कुगती वी हैव शिकारी देवी गोविंद गोविंद वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी वैली ऑफ फ्लावर्स नेशनल पार्क सुल्तानपुर सरिस्का ओके यू कैन सी दिस मैप वेरी वे वी हैव सुंदरबंस वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी ओके वी हैव गोदाबिल बर्ड वाइल्ड लाइफ सेंचुरी वी हैव गुनार we have indravati we have kankar valley we have papi kondula we have uh, tadoba okay we have melkot we have this pa- paniyar we have nayar we have mandan thulal we have iduki we have venar nagar hole sharavathi these are the na- in this wildlife sanctuaries that you can zoom up the figure and can see this very well here this is the biodiversity of wild animals wild life plants and animals you can see here india is having a rich wildlife flora and fauna now going to the biosphere reserves we have 18 biosphere reserves and uh, at number 1 this is the nanda devi okay this is the number 1 nanda devi um, biosphere reserve we have nokrek sec at second number we have nokrek we have manas here it is nokrek and manas we have the Dib- we have dibru sakhurwa we have at fourth number we have the hang we have the hang the ba- the bang uh, that is found in this in this region uttar pradesh this um, in the easternmost part we have sundarbans in west bengal we have gulf of um, gulf of manar okay that is found here in the southern most part you can see manar gulf of manar we have nilgiri at eighth number we have great nicobar okay you can see here in indaman and nicobar islands we uh, we have similipal uh, sim- at tenth number that is found here in odisha we have kangin kangin zunga we have panchmari we have agasthali alal in 13th num- 13th number and some newly added these uh, biosphere reserves are here we have we have this achanak achanak mar we have amar kantak achanak mar we have amar kantak you can name it we have kachak we have cold desert we have sishaklam we have pana here you can see okay i i will also i will inshallah taala provide these maps to you okay you can see, you can very well understand by these maps by zooming up the figures okay this was all regarding today's lecture thank you my dear students thank you all